Actor Oscar Isaac can sing, can play guitar and sing those songs in Espanol and in English. And I'm going to show you right now. So Holly here at the Latino Slant, I, I, I put on my nice hat for this one because I love talking about music. I love sharing music with you guys. And we have a great duet single that just got released. It is with singer-songwriter and uh, award-winning uh, artist Gabby Moreno. She hails from Guatemala and she is friends and has collaborated in the past with actor Oscar Isaac. Actor Oscar Isaac? What? The guy in Dune? That guy? From Star Wars? Yeah, that guy. Because way before all that, he went to school for, for you know, for, as a musician. He's even done movies where he's singing and, uh, and playing the, the guitar. So uh, don't be too surprised. And I think you're going to be pleasantly surprised by this uh, new single. So here's what I'd like to do. Uh, I'd like to read a little bit about the information on the song. And then let's watch the song together. It's, it's gorgeous. I've been listening to the last 24 hours. I think it's over a hundred thousand views uh, just within a, a couple of days, and that's huge for Gabby Moreno, whose uh, YouTube channel is uh, relatively uh, not as huge as some of those, you know, like you know, Selena Gomez, that that type. Um, here you're getting two real Bohemian artists uh, in Oscar Isaac and in Gabby Moreno, and yes, both are from Guatemala. So let's go right now. Gabby Moreno and Oscar Isaac recreate the Guatemalan classic Luna de Chelayu. Oof. Let's, 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 let's read it, man. In 1948, the Guatemalan composer and guitarist Paco Perez wrote Luna de Chelayu, a famed waltz that became so popular, it's considered Guatemala's second national anthem. The song has endured through the decades. And it's one singer-songwriter, Gabby Moreno, has been performing since she was a teenager, even sang it on stage a few times with actor and musician Oscar Isaac. I, I like how they mentioned that, yes, he is a musician. Um, that is really, really fantastic. That they've performed this song several times over the years. All right, let's get back to our story. On Friday, Moreno and Isaac des decided to celebrate the roots by sharing an acoustic rendition of Luna de Chelayu alongside a music video that shows them singing on an empty, intimate stage at the Palace Theater in Los Angeles. Recording the track, Moreno says that it was a way of paying homage to the motherland. Um, you're you're going to see just how special Gabby is. Uh, that, that album, that LP right there, uh, that's Gabby's that she signed for me a few years ago. I've seen her live. Uh, she is a, you're going to see how, how special she is and how, how her singing and how her, where she comes, how she comes across with her song, with her singing. It's almost from another age. It's really a throwback. And so you'll, you'll see what I mean. Um, I, I just wanted to give you that, my, my little uh, cheerleading for, uh, for Gabby Moreno. We performed this song live together a few times and it's always been really special. Just like me, this song also means a lot to Oscar, and it honors his roots and family from Guatemala. I'm a huge fan of him as a singer and guitar player, she tells Rolling Stone. In the statement, Isaac adds that this version of Luna de Chelagu speaks to their connection as friends and artists. There's something that happens every time Gabby and I get together and sing that feels like coming home, Isaac said. A gentle synchronicity happens every time that is just so satisfying. She's an astonishing talent and dear friend who continues to inspire me as an artist and human being. Wow. Very nice. Very nice. The duet will appear on Moreno's upcoming project, uh, uh, Shemi. I think it is Yomi. Uh, I, for I forgot the, the pronunciation. I read it somewhere else. The album is out May 5th on Cosmica Artists. Big shout out to Gil Gastelum and Cosmica artists. I've known Gabby for a long time in her music because of her manager, Gil, man. He is a, he's an incredible, uh, uh, you know, uh, behind the scenes uh, uh, talent as well. The album is Moreno's first fully acoustic album with six songs she wrote and composed in addition to 
uh, Luna de Chelayu cover. I wanted to get back to the origins of the songs and how they sounded as soon as I finished writing them. All of you will hear is guitar and voice. It's my most personal intimate album yet. Well, there it is, guys. The project. Um, going back to Oscar, we haven't seen the song yet, right? You guys haven't seen it with me, but do you guys have kind of uh, you know preconceived you know judgments uh, in regards to actors who sing, or turn it around, actors who singers who go ahead and act? I tend to think, actually, I, I tend to know that no actor is just an actor, no singer is just a singer. Uh, they're often very bohemian and multi-talented. Uh, and you, you, you'd be surprised that maybe all oh, they're a great artist as well as an actor. A, uh, they've written novels as well as a rapper. It's out there. I'm just saying, I just want to know your, your thoughts on this. But now let's finally get to the song. And... Like I said, I've seen this before. And... Um... Oscar walking through the aisle with his guitar and meets Gabby and uh, let's enjoy this guys Downy man they get down I will have the Spanish lyrics in the video box description. It's gorgeous lyrics as well. And I'll put the link to this video um, that's got a really good uh, subtitles, a good, good translation, very poetic tra translation. Uh, but yeah, man, the tiny boy, that boy gets down like Charlie Brown. Show! Okay, here we go. Calles bañadas de luna que fueron la cuna de mi juventud. Vengo a cantar ya mi amada, mi luna plateada de mi cielo. Good melody, guys. Vengo a cantar ya mi amada, mi luna plateada de mi cielo. Oh my God. Luna de Xelahu. Xelahu. Que supiste alumbrar. I mean, she's really special, guys. En mis noches de pena, por una morena de dulce mirada. Mira. I got to tell you guys, nothing more brilliant than the balance of the male and the female voice singing, complimenting each other. And for me, growing up with, I have it on my shirt, boleros, um, I was always entertained by, by and fascinated by the female voice and then the male voice coming in. It just, it just does something to the soul. And uh, in, in, in it's it, like this song right here, right on point. Straight up beauty, very poetic. Um, again, Gabby Moreno, who's also done songs for uh, the Puss in Boots soundtrack and uh, Eleanor uh, soundtrack. Amazing. Here we go. Luna de Xerahu, me diste inspiración. La canción que te canto, regada con llanto de mi corazón. En mi vida no habrá más cariño que tú. Smooth, he's right underneath her, then they go together. 
this song i'm like it, the song just like made love to me ah <sighs> you know it's like you know and it, you can see you can hear the waltz in it you can hear this is stripped down acoustic and um um uh, final note i am gonna do a um a spotlight video on gabby i have uh, live footage of her i've been sitting on uh, and so, from some of her work here as well, so you can get to know more about Gabby Moreno. Um, what do you guys think? Go watch it. Go comment. It's it's the Latino slant's gift to you guys. This uh, music that's just so profound. All right, wherever you're at, keep your slant fuerte. Keep your slant fuerte.